Jay Xavier Sports. And yes, as you can see from the title, Allen Robinson is no longer going to be with the Jaguars. Yes, he signed a, a three-year deal worth $42 million, and he's going to the Chicago Bears out of all places. Me personally, I thought he would have ended up in, on you know the San Francisco 49ers or something like that when they were signing Richard Sherman and uh, having Jimmy G, uh, Jimmy Garoppolo and, uh, up there in San Francisco. But he chose to go to the uh, Chicago Bears. They probably offered him the best deal, so he took it. And, you know, congratulations to him. Um, you know, then this is being reported by Ian Rappaport, Josina Anderson, Adam Schefter. So, you know, they, you know, they usually are spot on with things like this. So, uh, you know, as it becomes official Wednesday, you know, uh, Al Robinson will no longer be with the, uh, with the Jaguars. So, you know, uh, I don't look at this as any bad, you know, particularly bad news or, you know, as like it's panic mode or anything like that. We sort of ex expected this to happen, you know. Let's be real about it. Um, there were reasons why he, why he should have came back, and that I thought he would come back. But you know, it's a business. You know, like I said, we we're becoming a better team. You know, we have other guys that we have on a priority list that we want to take care of. You know, on the defensive side of the ball, and we just didn't want to uh, commit long term to Allen Robinson, or we didn't want to commit that money to him. So. I don't see any problem with that. Um, I don't see any problem with him walking away. I have no ill will towards him or anything like that, you know. Who's to say that we we didn't offer him the same contract, you know, um, and then he just declined it, you know. We don't know what the story is, you know. We'll find out more as, you know, uh, more of the story starts to come out uh, about him leaving. But, yeah, I'm not at all disappointed. Like I said, from a business standpoint, you can see this scenario happen, uh, happening, so... You know, we look ahead towards free agency, the draft. Uh, you know, we're not worried. You know, like we, you know, like Jaguars fans have seen this year. You know, we've seen the emergence of Keelan Cole, D.D. Westbrook, players we've gotten last year uh, through the draft and undrafted free agency. And then you look at players like Marquise Lee and Alan Hearns, we still have to make decisions on. So um, it's not the end of the world. Uh, me personally, I feel like we do need to draft a wide receiver this year. Um, I don't think we should commit any – big money to a free agent wide receiver. Sammy Watkins would be one option that I would, uh, you know, that would be a favorable option in my opinion. But even in, you know, even in that scenario, I feel like we should just snag a, a tight end and uh, try to get a wide receiver in the draft. Maybe, maybe a couple wide receivers in the draft. Um, but, you know, as the Jaguars move on from here, like I said, you know, no, uh, we don't need to be worried about losing Allen Robinson. You know, like I said before in that uh, video I made with, about Allen Robinson, he still um, hasn't proven he can be a true, solid number one receiver. He had the one year that he put up the good stats. You know, we understand that. But um, we did see his numbers drop off the next year, and then he had the ACL injury. So he still has a, a lot to prove in the NFL. And uh, the Bears took a chance on him, you know. Um, so we're going to see how that works out. You know, he's going to be playing in the cold. So hopefully he likes, you know, to enjoy playing playing football like that in the snow. But, you know, this is a good thing for the Jaguars, you know, as far as money-wise. You know, we can put our attentions towards Aaron Colvin and uh, some of the other guys we want to, you know, maybe possibly sign back on the team and other guys are looking at free agency. So, you know, as free agency moves along, as other guys start to get signed and other dominoes start to fall, you know, it's going to be interesting to see – how this offseason shapes up, all the different guys going to different teams. And uh, it's going to be interesting to see what the Jaguars do. But that's all I have uh, for you guys now. If other things come out, uh, other things start to speculate and uh, surface uh, to the news as far as the Jaguars is concerned, and I'll definitely um, put a video up to, um, you know, give my opinion on that. And, uh, you know, I want to hear from you guys, see what you guys think about uh, Allen Robinson leaving. And, uh, you know, what do you think we should do from here? So definitely leave a comment in the comment section. Definitely subscribe if, if, if this is your first time watching um, any of my videos. I definitely do appreciate all the support everybody subscribing so far. It really does mean a lot to me. So I really do uh, thank you guys and appreciate that. All right. Thank you. This is Jay Xavier Sports. And I'm signing off. Appreciate you guys.